So there's like supposed to be other videos that I'm doing, but I'm gonna do this one because it's gonna be so much more fun. <laughs> Hi Felicities, this is Jen Victor. Welcome back to my channel. This channel doesn't have a name, so deal with it. Avi, like we're just gonna keep it. Me introducing myself, you clicking on the video, and hopefully liking the content. And if you don't, press the down button. I don't really care. It's your life. You do you. I do what I want. You do what you want. Um, so thanks for tuning back in to the new Felicities. Uh, if you haven't subscribed and actually enjoy what you're about to see and just, you know, this mess, um, like and subscribe and thumbs up. That's what I mean by like, and also comment, because if you want to see more, if you have any questions, whatever it is, I definitely, you know, like, this is all about having a conversation. I am going to do a video right now. It is not the video that I've been talking about. Um, that's still in the works, because I'm still trying to process in my head. Obviously, y'all know that I do my videos in, like, one take. I kind of sort of don't plan it. I kind of do plan it. I kind of don't really. Uh... But that bag collection video is coming up. Hopefully this, like, video is, like, it might be a little, like, tilted. I don't know. My, like, this whole setup. Whatever. Just deal with it. Like, it's about the content, right? <laughs> um, also, if you notice, I kind of changed up my room setup a little bit back to the original setup. So in the back, my clothes are back. Um, I cleaned my room after, like, a month and a half or two of just hot mess. Uh, so I am like really excited, motivated, want to do videos, make videos for y'all. And today I'm actually going to be doing a reveal slash unboxing. And it's not for me. Um, really quick context if y'all know, maybe like what, two weeks ago or something? It was like Mother's Day. I think, yeah, Mother's Day. And so we got our mom a gift. And this isn't the bag that we got her. I'm already going to clarify that. So we bought her like a, the Dummy Bean Alma PM. Um, from Louis Vuitton, and the reason why we got that is because they showed her my Alma BB, and we were like, oh, would this bag be cute? And she said, yeah, maybe bigger, and so we got it for her, but she like liked it, and then she ended up changing her mind, so she changed it out on her own. I wasn't there with her, so I don't have any footage, but I am just going to reveal to you the bag that she got, and kind of just like my first impressions, and just like I guess like, you know, if you ever buy somebody a gift from Louis Vuitton, we tried to get her to the store before we actually bought the gift from Mother's Day, but there was a lot of complications. So definitely, if you're going to buy somebody a gift, you better either know exactly what they want or let them go with you. Um, but it happens. Uh, I am just glad this is the Alma, the Damier. It, the Damier Ibin Alma PM was her first, technically like new from the store Louis Vuitton unboxing, but this is the one, this is basically her first pick. Um, and so she basically paid the difference of the bag price that uh, she switched out for since the new bag she got was a little more expensive. But yeah, we're just gonna get to unboxing it and then I'll talk a little bit about it and then I'll also give some life updates. Hair toss, hair toss, and today I'm just wearing a basic tank top. I just came from, I just came from like work and just, I, my arms are a little tan. I'm trying to tan my whole upper body and just get back to my brown skin tone. And just my Zara joggers, um, yeah, they're really cute, like, let's see. Oop. Ah! <laughs> yeah. So, if you haven't seen the Zara joggers, I have like two of them, they're all over my Instagram, check it out. But definitely, joggers, they're super fun, and I'm like really into it, and they're like stretchy because I have really big legs. If you know my Instagram, you know that I have pretty big legs, so these pants help. So we're gonna get started, but basically, this is the bag that she got it in. So, obviously, she's not really into getting filmed, so I'm just doing the reveal for y'all here. Um, we actually, my sister does calligraphy, and we got a card, um, but we wrote her a letter, and my sister did this calligraphy. And this is from the Louis Vuitton um, South Coast Plaza in Costa Mesa. Uh, I don't know if you can see it. Whatever. Yes, yeah, so it's a really cool card. I'm not going to open it for you because it's like personal. Um, we wrote it as siblings. Um, me and my siblings shipped in for the, the original bag we got her. So, you know, cool, cool. And so this is the cute little box that it comes in. I think it might be about 
If not, it's the same size that my Alma PM is in. I'm uh, sorry, Alma BB. Uh, and it has the leather band, and I really love this little, I guess, card thing. I think it's a card. Yeah, you can put like a card in it, but it's just a cute, cute Fleur de Lis design with Louis, v Louis Vuitton. Um, uh, Maison, like, name, whatever you want to call it. So I'm going to just open it. And I'm not gonna lie, I do like the bag that she did get. Like, I think the Damia Ibin um, Alma PM is, was also a good choice, but this is, this is actually a really good choice too. So this is the top part, bottom part, and this is the dust bag. She got a really big dust bag. <laughs> they give her a really big one. Um, and I know what this is actually. Oh, this was the other card. So this is what the card would look like. This is, I guess they gave her another one. Um, this is the inside of the card that Louis Vuitton gives for, um, you know, if you're giving it as a gift. It's really cute. Like, look at that. Like, that's... It's just so cute. I want to get my own trunk like that and just fill it with flowers. <laughs> one day. <laughs> like, seriously, like, can somebody just, like, buy me a Louis Vuitton, like, vintage trunk? I know, like, Bobster. Ugh, Bobster 92. Um, Bobby Loves LV. That's his Instagram. He's totally want, like, he had pictures on his Instagram of, like, a vintage Louis Vuitton trunk. So gorgeous. Totally want one. I don't even have a private jet, but who wouldn't want a personal Louis Vuitton vintage trunk? So this is the dust bag. I'm gonna pull it out and reveal it to you because actually, oh, you see a little bit of the V. This is the, I believe it is called, and I'm actually gonna have to pull up the <laughs> receipt because it's, I, the name escapes me, the Kensington Bowler, um, the Louis Vuitton, eh, Kensington Bowler in Damier Ebin. Um, and it is, oh my goodness, it is just, it's actually really gorgeous. This is a seasonal bag. I had to call the South Coast Plaza store because I looked it up online. And you won't really find much information. It'll just say call for inquiry. And I think my mom got probably the first shipment, if not, th that they got in. And you know, like, with seasonal bags, they're only in for that short amount of time. We don't know if they're going to stay. But this is, uh, if you know the, like, I think it's a Kensington bag. It's kind of like a tote bag with this V style, but this one, so you, you see kind of like how it looks right now. It, it's like a bowler bag, so it actually has a top zip. Um, it's really gorgeous, and then the interior, I mean, y'all know how I feel about just like reds and burgundies, those kinds of use, and it's just like, it's just like, I wish it was like that, but this is also like amazing. Like, it's, ugh. I, I actually didn't mind, like, I like the color, like, palette, but it would have been perfect if it was red. Because, uh, if y'all, oh, I don't think I've ever featured it. I gotta show that bag, um, I gave it to my mom, but it's a vintage red epi, uh, speedy, and I just love reds and the interior, but I like this kind of salmon interior that they have, and it comes with, she hasn't set it up, but it comes with, uh, shoulder thing, but I know my mom would probably never use this, so she actually is more of a top handle kind of person. And it's really gorgeous because you have the top handle, you can hold it at the crook of your arm, um, and it just has this really great V detailing. Um, she didn't inspect it when we got it and I had to like double check it, um, and it looks, it looked good. It looks good. Um, I think it's... Let me just double check. I, oh, it's just a little dusty. I think she just needs to. Oops. She just needs to clean the, the gold a little. Um, I'm gonna do it right now. Give me a second. Give me a second. Just make it shiny. Oh gosh. Yeah. So there's the V, and then there's also actually. Outside of the zipper, there is a pocket right here, and it also has that salmon look. Um, and in the back too. So there is basically one compartment, the main compartment, which has two, which has a big, like, little uh, pocket, and then two small pockets, and then you have the third pocket um, that's outside of the zip compartment, and then these are the different, you know, like, what loops where you put the, the rings. Um, not the rings, the, the strap. 
But yeah, I think it's a really great piece. Um, it's gorgeous, and I, I definitely, I definitely, I mean, I know some books are like opposed to seasonal stuff, but part of it, and I was just watching Mel Soldera, and she was talking about like buying bags and selling bags, and bags are meant to be loved, used, and if not, sold. Because if you're not using it, then what's the point? Um, and that's kind of where I'm at. And so I think this is a really good piece if you want to get a Damier Bean piece. Um, it's really functional, I think. Oh, I don't... I don't think you can fit a laptop, but you can probably fit a MacBook. Like, you can fit a good amount of stuff in here. Like, just look at that. Like, that's a pretty big, that's a pretty big, like, some just amount of space. So, definitely, uh, this was her Mother's Day gift. Um, we kind of added into it, but I definitely say check out the Kensington piece. I think I just saw somebody take pictures of it on Instagram, and, um, it's cool. Like, it, you know, it's like it's a new piece, and, um... Yeah, I'm really ex I'm, I'm, I'm. This is a piece that I'm, I actually got me a little bit excited about Louis Vuitton because the Palm Springs collection, like the one with the, oh, I gotta mention. I'm mentioning a bunch of YouTubers, but like Doc Luxury, they have like he has a, um, uh, a series on his channel called like Men on Bags or Men with Bags, something like that. And you gotta watch it. It's, they're really funny. Um, it's with uh, Frozen Luxury too, and they kind of just have conversations and. I didn't really feel the the one with the Louis Vuitton Palm Springs with the like the kind of print stuff on the inside on the not the inside like one of them is like the toiletry pouch and it has like palm leaves and circles and it's just a little busy and I love the simplicity of this like yeah I love to be busy I love to be fabulous and extra but sometimes like just classic understated um, so definitely I would say check it out um oh and i didn't mention it has four feet i'm supposed to do that whole thing but <laughs> where i talk about the features of the bag it has four feet but i don't really think it's gonna do much more or less uh but check this bag out it's new um it's from this season uh louis the louis vuitton collection and it's a take it's a different take on the kensington bag and if you want something with more privacy this definitely is your bag so check it out, um, and yeah, I'm gonna put this down really quick. I just oh, let me put it right here. So that's the that's my like initial bag thoughts, bag review of of the bag that my mom just bought. Um, definitely, I don't know. Like it's a nice, you know, like I mean, any luxury handbag is a nice gift for like Mother's Day or for somebody special. They don't have to be a woman. It could be anybody who just really likes bags. Um, but yeah, it's. Always like, you know, do your research, take the time, and just because it's a luxury piece doesn't mean they're gonna love it or uh, it's what they want. Like, yes, it is nice to be able to say, like, I have a Louis Vuitton piece, a Chanel bag, I have a blah 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 shoes, but I think it's like also just think about the person and think about what you're getting them, and really going back to that whole like reference with Mel Soldera is um, it's a bag that they're gonna get use out of and that fits with their style, um, and that they're gonna wear, because most folks, you know, like, there's a lot of folks, I feel like I watch a lot of YouTube videos, and I hear some folks say, like, yes, I have this $5,000, $6,000 bag that I only use once, or I've only used once or twice in the past year that I've had it, and it's like, girl, why? Like, why do you even have it? Like, yeah, it's an investment, but, like, I don't want my investment to sit. And so, that goes back into the whole, like, handbag collection thing that's coming. Um, and I'm actually, with the handbag collection, I'm des I've decided that I'm going to do kind of, like, general review of each bag and thoughts. Um, and then why I'm potentially thinking of selling certain ones. But I decided to give myself more time to really think about, like, which bags I want to let go. Because it is also a part of you. And so, I want it... I, I don't want to um, jump the gun, but also at the same time, I want to, I don't want to hoard stuff. So, yeah, that's the, this is, uh, I gotta read it because I'm still getting used to the name. This is the Kensington Bowler in the Damier Ibn from Louis Vuitton, and the price is, before tax, it's $2,220. Um, so you can add a tax depending on where you are, or if you get value added tax or that for you, whatever, um, but I think it's a good piece, and definitely this is, th I think this is a piece that, like, I'm probably gonna be borrowing, 
Let's be real. That's why you gotta get your mom, your siblings, your family to get on like designer bags. So you could be like, buy this bag, use it once, and after you use it, you can buy it away. <laughs> um, so thanks for tuning into my channel, Felicities. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's totally way longer than expected because I just talk like a lot. So yeah, if you liked the video, click the like button down below. If you didn't like it, you can click the down button, but it's okay. Um, and if you have any questions or whatever, like, feel free to comment. Um, also, if you want to see pictures of this, I'll be actually posting some of the pictures of this on Instagram. Um, so that's, uh, Fierce Renegade. That's F-I-E-R-C-E. -E, Fierce Renegade. R-E-N-E-G-A-D-E. -E. And, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this video. And hopefully, you know, since this is probably the first video or first couple of videos that's coming up and first look at this bag, I will, once she uses it, do a follow-up review. Um, but yeah, thanks for tuning in, and I hope to see y'all later. Bye, Felicity! I'm gonna push the button, so I'm gonna put my hand right here, like you see. I'm looking at you, but I'm actually looking at the viewfinder. <laughs>